because it keeps flagging us every time I upload to YouTube. Uh, Wait, also, seriously? Yeah, every time because it's like it's so good. <laughs> it sounds just <laughs> like iCarly. I we technically did use like a melody remake, like somebody like remade the melody, and it's oh. Reezus, like personal vocals. But fuck, you could just put Reezus vocals on something and be good. Um, but chat, we're gonna we're gonna just hit that. Uh, we're gonna hit that. We're ready. Uh, Twitch, are you ready to be visually live? You're gonna be on your I, face I, out there. Is is ready as. Chat, we're I doing can this. be. Okay, here we go. Intro. Yeah, I hope this works. I changed it a little bit. Here we go. There we go. There we go. All right, it's moving, guys. It's moving. Yeah, we got some new stuff out there. Some old stuff. Move some stuff around. Sonic Man is now sitting down over there. <laughs> he took my spot because I'm. I'm in. Why would I be in the audience? I'm here. What am I doing in? <laughs> what am I doing in the crowd? <laughs> oh, <laughs> this is your new model. We made you a new model over here. A, a high resolution, high frame rate uh, VTuber model. Uh, <laughs> here it comes. Here comes your spot. Can you wave in time? Oh! Wait, wait. oh my god, it really works. Hey gamer, look, check was, it out. I was looking at the right Yo! window that time. Oh, what's up, look gamers? At that. What's going on? Welcome Man, everybody. What are you doing way over there? <laughs> Come over here. Yo! Oh, I didn't realize how far that camera angle is. We should probably zoom that in. Is that right? <laughs> yeah. Studio. <laughs> bring it in. Bring it in. Bring, bring it in. in. Uh, we're, we're a little fuzzy. Close it up. There we go. Okay. I don't know why that did that. <laughs> That's not supposed to do that. Hey, gamers. Welcome. Hello, everybody. We can turn down the game music. The music. Gaming music. Um, hello. Music gaming. How's the audio? Is audio good compared to us, compared to the music, compared to Twitches, compared to me? How we sound? Hello? Highly cursed. What, Twitches? <laughs> what's up, gamer? Always. Always. Hey, guys! <laughs> what's going on? It, it, we, <laughs> I've officially fully became a VTuber. <laughs> it's happened. It's real. I'm really a VTuber now, guys. It's crazy. I So, thought? I took the VTuber pill, apparently. Um, you guys should see what's going on in the background of this thing. Uh, I'm still working on it. I'm still trying to understand what it's like to be a VTuber. How much does the surgery cost? Uh, $300 in total. <laughs> if you really actually want to know the numbers when you put it all together. Um, but yeah, so obviously Elf in the Room, uh, we fixed Twitches. <laughs> I know it's crazy. It's frame rate. I, I know. I'm not a PNG tuber anymore, dude, or a JPEG is, tuber rather. Dude, Excuse me. This is a crazy me. long journey, but we're here after all this hard work. Twitches has frames. This is crazy. Yes, bro, this is crazy. So, um, I've officially squashed every bug, every single one of them. There's no other issues that will ever appear uh, while we're doing banter buddies. All the problems are gone. Every single never. One. Never again. Yeah, not, not a single problem left. Uh, I prefer the left. Uh, well, you know, political uh, statements are not welcome in the chat, but we appreciate that. <laughs> 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 anyway, sorry. Uh, hello, welcome to the stream, everybody. Uh, I'm Mr. Chris Mad. Uh, this is my co-host. You can introduce yourself. You know how to do it. I'm Twitches. This is my co-host. Mr. Chris is mad. You're looking the damn wrong way. Wait, I'm doing it too. <laughs> Wait, I need to put you over here so I look over at here. You right. You're over here. Okay, I'm now okay. going to put you over there so when I look at you, there. I'm looking at you. There. I'm dude, being a VTuber is fucking weird, dude. Um, but you know what's cool? Don't have to do my hair. <laughs> I don't have to do anything. Dude, I'm great. <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> Man, I'm, I'm, I'm jealous. <laughs> Man, you're way behind. Way behind, man. You got to become a VTuber. Um, so yeah, I became a VTuber, uh, I'll go, I'll go through quickly, cause I don't want to take up the whole podcast just talking about like, oh, how do I became a VTuber? I should make a video. <laughs> I, I became a VTuber in a week is a pretty good video idea. Um, but the short of it is, uh, there was an artist, uh, that I reached out to. So I didn't make the model, uh, at all. Don't, don't think I'm that good. I'm not that good. Um, but I did modify it heavily. Uh, because the original version of the model uh, would not have done uh, what it needed to do. So let's go ahead and uh, we'll go to video here real quick. 
Hope that works. And then turn it on. Over to the screen. There we go. Yeah. So uh, um, that's the original model. Uh, and this model is by uh, Callist Art. <laughs> Callist Art. Uh, I'll put a... I'll definitely... Somebody remind me to put it in the description as well when the video comes out. Um, C-A-E-L-E-S-T-I-S-A-R-T. Callist Art. They made this model for me. I paid them money to, to make this model for me. Um, but it was just a model with a rig. Um, and I actually really actually know how to rig things. And I know how to use Blender enough to, like, make a model. Um, I'm just not good at making people yet. It's just not in the cards yet. Uh, but I do have enough understanding uh, to, like, use Blender to put things together. So then uh, I went to... A uh, certain person, their name is Voxoid. I hope I say that right. The, I People stop. Uh, just uh, Mr. Chris Mad's an easy name. Make an easy name. This is nomadic. Easy name. Voxoid. Uh, they have a Patreon, and their Patreon is very cheap. And they teach you how um, to make uh, VTubers out of uh, low-poly models. Like, they literally have a step-by-step -step tutorial that... I can't find anywhere else on the internet. It doesn't exist. Um, so following that tutorial, step-by-step, uh, step, got me to where I have the eyes and the mouth moving. I did actually, uh, if we close up real quick. Oh, Whoa. <laughs> we got to work Whoa. on close-ups. This will work. Uh, I got to work on island. camera angles. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I wanted to get the <laughs> emphasis on the little toys. Um, but I, I actually did the pixel art for the mouth. Because uh, I wanted teeth, and the original art didn't have that. And for what it's worth, I asked uh, Callist Art, like, hey, I'm going to modify the model. Is that okay? And they were, like, totally cool with it. Because um, I, I don't like modifying someone else's art piece when they, like, made it for me. Um, but we had to do it to make it happen. Can there be middle figures? Here you go. Uh, there you go. Look at that. Um, uh, and then finally, um, the actual animation of it is it has to go to unity it has to become a vrm which is for like stuff like a uh, vr chat and then a vc face and then i have a hand tracker because the big thing i had like i've always we've talked about it uh, a few times before on banner buddies but like visnomatic and vtubing was kind of like always on the chopping block because like we had like the idea of like little characters in the corner and they would talk <laughs> like forever ago but the thing i had a problem with with uh like 2d vtubing is hands i'm a big hand talker i talk with my hands i'm italian i, I like i talk i talk with these it's part of my expression uh when i when i want to <laughs> emphasize things so 3d vtubing kind of became uh my goal and i had that goal for like five years but I just, this program, this motion program started me on a fucking snowball effect of like learning Blender. And then I learned how to rig models. And then I learned how to import models into the thing. Then I learned how VTubing worked. Then I learned how to make a model into a VTuber. Then I took Vroid and made that a model. Then I put that into this program. Then I learned how to do this. Then I learned Blender. Then I and now here I am. That easy, this guys. Way. You can do it's it too. <laughs> it's that easy. <laughs> Just go ahead and do it. <laughs> why aren't you? Why haven't you guys done it yet? Um. Uh. Someone uh, shake my head. People talking with their hands without learning. <laughs> I know a little sign. Uh, like this. <laughs> uh, there you go. Uh, that means hello, in Portuguese. Uh, which is what have you been? What did you learn the last week? What have I learned the last week? I've I've been avidly not learning. <laughs> no, I'm I've 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 been on I I I I'm, I'm taking a, a Japanese course and everything. I I don't know if I've told you guys or not. I've, if, I've I'm sure I've not been obnoxious about this in the slightest. Uh, no, I I I, I finished up my first semester of that and had my final and it went well, uh, all things considered. And that's good, you know. Yeah, no, I'm I'm happy with that. So we're 
I'm on a little bit of a break before the next semester starts up, so. Oh, good. That's good. Yeah. So yeah. yeah, no, it's 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 been it's been good. So it's that's that's what I've if anything what if what I've learned is like what, what do I do after I take a beginner's Japanese course? So that's kind of the, the next the longest, whole what's whole the longest step. sentence you can say? Uh oh god, that's not Japanese. <laughs> You're putting me on the spot. I want to know every um, word you know. What's the worst word? You every know single word that I know, I need. I need to. I mean, that being said, Naughty. I do need to kind of like keep studying so I don't like forget over the over the month. But uh, konnichiwa. no, konbawa. Kombini. Sumimo san. What are <laughs> uh chan? <laughs> Twitch is okay. chan. <laughs> Get out of there! That's what you're doing. You're being a menace. Twitches, uh, Twitches, don't go to the void. <laughs> Twitches has gone to the void. Everybody, everyone, cat stream. That was so cat weird. This is the weirdest moment I've had in my life since doing this. Cheshire cat. I was gonna go grab my cat and show my cat, <laughs> and I can't do that. Oh my god, VTubing's terrible. Who would do this? <laughs> Who would be a VTuber? You can't show your cat. There we go. <laughs> Twitch is win. We'll just make a VTuber model for your cat. Problem solved. Oh my god. <laughs> and it tracks. <laughs> like it actually tracks the cat. <laughs> Dude. For real though. Momo's a VTuber um, now. But I, I've only uh, scratched the surface with the VTuber stuff for sure. Yeah. Yeah. So, and I, 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 this started as like a bit that like went too far. Like, I was doing the VTuber thing as a bit, because, like, I wanted to just emphasize what the program could do. And then I, <laughs> I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Should we get every Vizno a VTuber model? Uh, gets a hell model. yeah. They're expensive Everyone gets well. a model. They're expensive. Hey, guys, remember, we have a Patreon. <laughs> if you Tell give them below. Money, if you, if, you, if you donate to our Patreon, the... we'll make everybody a VTuber. That's the rules. Every year, thousands of people don't have a VTuber model. And for only $80 a month, you can provide some of them with a VTuber model over time. Do you know where your VTuber model well, is With at? your continued <laughs> su support. <laughs> there you Come go. On, guys. Make it happen. Yeah, I don't want to make up certain. Uh, once again, guys, we are in the motion studio, though. Um, if you want to see the studio audience, you actually guys can all creatively, like, each say, let's go see the studio audience. I think it's exclamation point audience. I got to make sure that's on, though. Uh, the, where's the program? <laughs> I also learned that if you minimize the program, it also takes away less resources. Who knew? Uh, we're going to close that. And then... Uh, there's also a new one, uh, which is going to be our word of the day. And let me double check what the word is, because I forgot again. Uh, <laughs> and that was I'll, fast. I'll look, I'll look at case sensitivity. Uh, let's see. I also need ideas for the wheel, because we do have a wheel. Uh, it's not that. Not that. Where is it? Where is it? Guys, you don't understand. This is like coding. I'm literally coding with a node system. Oh, you can control the UFO. So if you type in exclamation point UFO and then a nautical direction letter, so like north is N, um, the little UFO in front of us will move around. So you guys could have fun with that. Who would have thought? Um, Look at okay. him go. So here's the hint, guys. Uh, it is a chat program that we all used in high school if you're a millennial. With an exclamation point, all lowercase. And it also is what you're going to be doing when you get there. So there you go. Good luck with that. <laughs> so exclamation point. A chat program we all used. It might have been the first chat program you guys all used. I see Q. There you go. Not quite. Got it. <laughs> and all lowercase <laughs> as well. Um, it's also a word. Like it's a real word. You would say word. You, you chatted with fun. I Oh, 
Did we get oh, one? Oh. oh, okay. All right. Aim. Okay. Now <laughs> you did it. That was quick. That's the quickest one we've had in like years. Oh. Yeah, that was, that's an easy one. That's that was pretty quick. Uh, okay. Now uh, do that. <laughs> Next vision point fire. Do that. Go ahead. I'll wait. <laughs> Al. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So this this particular version of the model has physics on. So if enough people hit me, I will die. So uh, <laughs> go ahead. <laughs> Try your best. <laughs> go ahead. <laughs> Make my day. <laughs> it's not like that. You can't fire 50 times. <laughs> That's not how that works. Ow. <laughs> All right. Go ahead. Ow. Ow, ow. Ow. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Ow. Ow. I, I forget how much health I gave myself. Ow. Uh, does it show how much health I have? Ow. Slowly Ow. getting there. Ow. 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 Oh, you oh. got it. You got it. Good job, guys. <laughs> Ow, you killed me. Okay, great. All right, cool. You All right. Me. Now, my clone, hey, guys. I thought you were dead. This, I was supposed to take over the podcast yeah, now. Sorry, I'll I was supposed to be the last one. Yeah, it's all twitches. Go ahead. Try to <laughs> control this. You thought <laughs> I was going to be the next one to leave. <laughs> try to understand this podcast. I, I, we don't even do things that are podcast. <laughs> like, no. A, hey. No. Yeah, like, I actually want to ask you, like, how uh, dramatic do you want to get? Because I wanted to talk about, like, the VTuber stuff that's been happening that's not great. <laughs> Have you heard about that crap? I have not, actually. So, uh, <laughs> Sylvia talked about it on her, like, personal stream, but, like, uh, a VTubing group called Mizu Sanji. I, I haven't done enough research myself. But yeah. the short of the point is, is that one of their creators, Signaline, was the name of, the, like, their character that's on. And that's a weird thing with, like, VTuber production companies, is that, like, you're a personification, that you're, you're like an actor, but you're just yourself as this yeah. acting character uh so they split um because creative differences was one aspect that i understand and that they produced a video released it but then the parent company uh basically blocked it and uh removed the video oh and saline put actual money into it so like Ooh. that was kind of like real issues so now we're at a point where they've gone to their original personification. Uh, like, they had their own personal VTuber model character that they had originally done that was freelance. Um, and they go live for, like, fourth stream they've done. And the Niji, Niji Sanji... I hope I'm saying that. I don't even know. I think that's uh, it, yeah. that, that uh, I, I know of the name. But. Yeah, so they just put out a post saying, like, oh, well... Uh, here are our creators that are speaking out against uh, Saline because she leaked personal information about all the other members. And the information sheet that had the personal information were legal documents that were for the court case <laughs> that they're going to have. So they just admitted oh. that they uh, leaked private documents to their staff. And, like, <laughs> Celine, who now goes by Doki, is like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, I'm just trying to play Neopets, dude. So, shit's crazy. Shit's, like, yeah. actually crazy. Um, but, like, that's why I never... Like, even if Zematic had grown any bigger than it did, like, I would never, like, try to own what each creator had. Like, uh, it's actually one of the topics I had today is, like, I kind of wanted to... That made me look at our old uh, mission statement. Did you ever read that? Ages ago. <laughs> yeah, I, I hope <laughs> yeah. we're still staying by it. So I thought, let's look at it and see if we're still standing by it, right? That's kind of important. Uh, let's go to video. Uh, we got to work on Twitch's being cut off on the screen, though. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Scoot me over. Yeah. There's a floating uh, Pikmin here. Start chatting. On... Oh, is he floating right now? Damn They're angles. all kind of floating, I guess. Damn angles. <laughs> now, he's, now he's sinking. <laughs> Dude, 3D space, man. How does it work? Okay. So, uh, chat, is that big enough? Chat, is that big enough? 
F11. Chat, is that big enough? Chat, is that big enough? Can you read that chat? No, probably not. How about, <laughs> How about now? How about now? How about now? It's a little big. Can I make this bottom part go away? Hello? Uh. Yeah, that's probably good enough. <laughs> we'll work with it. Hey, chat. Okay. So, this is the actual mission. St like, literally, from, like, 2011. When did we start Vizomatic? 2012? Ten years ago. 2014. Yeah. 2014. Yeah, ten years. Um. So, uh, this is literally what I gave to people when I said, hey, I want you to join Vizomatic, and they said yes. Okay, they're like, well, what this is the mission statement. Uh. So, first off, Vizomatic is a combination of words, vision, and nomadic. I really wanted people to know that. <laughs> That's the whole <laughs> naming reason. Uh, Did you reason. know that that co-founder of Vizomatic uh, Twitches uh, uh, went with, said to say, Vizomatic instead of Vizio Nomadic? It used to be Vizio Nomadic. Yeah. Which... Did you know? <laughs> <laughs> And then Twitch is just like, your your you annual uh, uh, did just you know this nomadic co-founder <laughs> Twitch is here decided that okay um, first off Vizomatic is a combination of the words vision nomadic meaning we seek new ideas and create endlessly new content never sticking the same ideas and always changing um, it's a collection of cool people bringing entertainment to the masses for the people a part of it it's to help get your name out there or help you see what you uh, or to help others see what you produce. It's a hard point I make where I want to see you all successful in the content you create. And I want to help by uh, being a stepping stone to get you launched. And as a benef uh, beneficiary factor, uh, have some of your fellow peers grow as well. As an added point, you'll get involved in all sorts of new creative submissions as time goes on. Your degree of commitment is of your personal standards. If you want to go all out and help with some of the core shows and participate in our let's plays or simply just want to be known to, as an associate is up to you the mission is that you a creative and talented person are part of a group of peers who share the same interest in creating entertaining and interesting content from streaming to music to videos to let's plays to art uh, this however does not mean you forfeit anything of your own nor do you need to curve anything about your current marketing or inner circles this channel is a network to help share viewers and increase audiences all across the board along with having a blast with cool people who have cool ideas. Um, I honestly, I'm proud of me. <laughs> that was, like, yeah, that was so forward-thinking in the modern day of, like, what a network was. Like, I, I wanted, whenever you joined, you are still you, and I always want you to be you, and I want you to grow the way you are. If you're done with Vizomatic and you've grown too big, go ahead, head out. That's it. That's the deal. I'm cool with it. Uh, help out as much as you want that that big emphasis that i like um you can be like one video a year to being in every video every day it's totally up to you like i thought that was big yeah. proud of that uh ooh, doxing myself uh <laughs> <Oops. network laughs> oh well uh this network is not aff affiliated with vga turbo or any other community i remember i had to put this though <laughs> like oh yeah. Uh, yeah or any other uh current community this network was created for its own views and goals as important note you do not forfeit any right to create content on your personal channels nor do we ask you to change anything this network is directly about you for who you are any video content created will be passed by chris me and be reviewed and then uploaded uh that's kind of changed over time but basically i still see it as it goes up uh, as a member it is encouraged to share your talents with others and in return you will do the same for our increased efforts to bring content to others uh, at its current state vismatic is a non-profit organization uh, it's simply a hub to connect all our content. If one day Vizomatic starts to receive an income, its funding goes towards our future site, VTubers, and projects. I don't... I need to add that. <laughs> no revenue will be going towards <laughs> any member until a certain threshold is made. Income management will be regulated by Chris for the time being. For now, Vizomatic is a nonprofit organization to produce content and increase audiences. So, uh, nonprofit is probably not the legal term I should be using uh, when I put this, but it's like, no... Like, I don't take a paycheck. Um, basically it's a pool of money and I work a day job and everyone else like, you know, lives their normal lives. And when somebody needs something, we take from the money pit and we go, here you go. This is, this is for you, for your project, or here's a new microphone or, oh, your graphics card died. Here's that for you. And it's always been like that. Um, 
you hold all right to your content you produce with Vizomatic, for example. Any video produced by you is owned by you, and uh, any changes or removal can be made on your word. However, as lead organizer, I will make judgment calls uh, when they're being reviewed before uploading. Your involvement with Vizomatic is up to you, meaning you can either help on everything or simply be on call for special projects. Uh, with the joining of this network, anytime you announce your personal projects, this is the one thing we don't do, uh, via Twitter, Facebook, or Twitch, it will be forwarded on Vizomatic's platforms in exchange for promotion for Vizomatic will directly benefit you, your peers, and Vizomatic self. Um, which is okay. I mean, like, it, it's not expected both ways for everyone to, like, retweet everybody and everything else. Um, current show list. Uh, Let's Plays, <laughs> which we Oh, did. man. Uh, current almost, show list. Uh, I know. That's my favorite thing. Uh, our most common show, Vizomatic. Enjoy the idea of daily content, something for uh, the viewer every day. So that's where this show comes from. Uh, every Sunday to Wednesday, uh, we will usually have a Let's Play in a different game or cast every day. Usually filmed in bulk and then released the following weeks. Footage is mostly commonly recorded for each person and then edited together by Chris. Uh, we will usually uh, supply PC tools you'll need for recording. Uh, but for console titles, you'll need a capture card, uh, which we did. We like, we literally like. At the start, we got oh, everybody yeah. set up with OBS. There was a thing called the X Tory. Oh my god, I want to get into that. That'd be a whole topic. Um, oh, the X Tory. Like oh, how we god. recorded shit in the past. Uh, sit down. Yeah. Our first variant on the Let's Play aspect. Simply enough, uh, these are single player games, but viewed by us via online screen sharing tools like team <laughs> like team viewer <laughs> oh jesus uh we use <laughs> we usually choose games such as rpgs action adventures <laughs> that don't usually need a majority of a focus of task so basically a let's play where everyone's playing like it's one player playing bottom shelf offline Oop, doxing again. doxing, <laughs> doxing again. uh flash games with enter uh a weekly show where uh doxing again <laughs> doxing again <laughs> Uh, e for Edo. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, no. But it, uh, you know what? We're very transparent, and I'll I'll blurp this out during the edit. <laughs> so chat, don't look the vod. Um, e for Edo, one of our <laughs> newest series. Edo plays a game blindly about once a month. I took away a lot of these shows where it was like one person playing a game. Like I did flash games, Enter did, uh, or Enter did flash games. I did any games. Edo did E for Edo. Mm -hmm. There was another one that was supposed to be for Twitches called Kicking It with Twitches. Uh, he would do Kickstarter. <laughs> I forgot about that. He was supposed to do all I, the Kickstarter games. I think we did like one recording for that. I don't even know if that recording like actually became anything. anything. I, uh, I I remember the recording too. Open I, party. Open party is something I wish we could get back. Uh, we just don't stream enough. But open party was supposed to be like play with the viewers. Uh, mm -hmm. I was uh, back then. I was a big fan of making show names. <laughs> I was, and that only stopped like. <laughs> Four years ago where i had like everything had a show name uh bot battle still one of my favorite shows uh the first in our catalog of different ways to play games the premise is simple where you get a game there's ai versus ai you bet on who wins your betting items are the things that are, you wear on your icon so when our icons were like full torsos we would have items on our icons and then we would trade them i forgot about that did, yeah that was so fun it was a fun way to like like develop the channel uh, guest for Dead. Miss that topic, too. Uh, a series in which we interview a guest star on Left for Dead. The concept is trying to conduct a serious interview while being attacked by zombies. That's a good... <laughs> that's still good. That's still a good one. Um, and then other stuff. I'm, I'm, I'm worried about doxing more. <laughs> 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 uh, but anyways, uh, I digress. So sorry for doxing, everybody. <laughs> but uh, you guys now know how we work. And that's how we do it. And I don't, I think we still stand by that. That was written a long ass time ago. And we still stand by a lot of that. Oh, um, yeah. yeah. Outside of like some of the shows. Yeah. It's just like, yeah, which is like, yeah. that's just it's, progress. It's all still there. That's the yeah. point of the, the beginning of the, of the statement was like, we're it, always yeah, changing. literally in kind of the opening paragraph of it is that it's always changing. So we're it's... always going to be changing stuff. Like I, like I never wanted to be known for something. And that's it, you know. And I know yeah. that that like does really bad for algorithm stuff. Like I'm completely aware that the way that we conduct Vismatic is like anti-algorithm in every way, shape, and form. We have way too many cast members, <laughs> you know. <laughs> Our upload schedule is a different game every day, so you can't have any consistency. 
we our podcast is once every two to three weeks <laughs> you know like we don't we don't know what we're doing it's only been 10 years we'll figure it out we'll get there we'll get there <laughs> Yeah, no. and then but yeah, that's, Twitch, that's, that's Twitches happened. will disappear for six years, and then I'll be back in full force. Yeah, <laughs> it's, it's, it's yeah good. exactly. It's totally fun. Twitch is why yeah, you're in your chair. Stand up. I'm, I'm, I am sitting up. You have me down low. Can you stand up? Can I stand up? Like, like yeah, can you stand up, please? I'm like, yeah, that's great. This is yeah, just like that. It's, it's like <laughs> what that. you do is you get two webcams. <laughs> If I if together. I go back, I just <laughs> I just get smaller. That's it. Yeah, but then I can scale you up. I can make you big. Whoa! So I'm huge. How far can you scooch back? Actually, I, I'm kind of curious how long, how far I can go back before I just and then disappear. I scale them up. And oh I god. knock everything over. Oh my god! The camera. The camera twitches. The camera. <laughs> what is it doing? Why does it do that? Why'd your camera do I think it's that? just freaking out because I'm so far away. It doesn't know what to do. Wh what was that? What is that? <laughs> what is the green? You're going in the Matrix. What's I happening? think that's something on your end, actually. Oh, no. It can't be. Oh, Not no. Possible. What did Not I possible. do? I fixed every issue what did in I do? motion. We talked about that. <laughs> uh, <laughs> let me make me big. There we go. And then I'll just be at his height. <laughs> it's there you go. There you go. So my hands look like fucking gorilla when I do this. <laughs> but that's fine. <laughs> gorilla. Um, chat, how you guys doing? Is there any ads out there? I can't tell. We don't have midnight to tell I me. I haven't seen ads. any yet that I noticed. Other than kind of like coming in. but Anything going on in the internet, guys? Anything cool that you guys heard about? Uh... Got any stories to bring? Why are you firing things at me? It's not even looking at me right now. <laughs> you have to aim first. Uh, so. Oh, is it not even like aiming at us by default anymore, or is it? Oh no, no. that was at the crowd. Yeah, it's a, it's it's over at. Uh, there's a shooting gallery now at the other side. Um. I wanted to. Did you bring anything to the table, Twitches? Let's see at your topics that you brought in. Hmm. Um. Not much this week, um, but we do have memes. <laughs> Good news, guys. We have memes. We have no topics. We got we memes, guys. Memes. Some that some people in this chat have seen already. <laughs> right, I, guess, I guess it's meme time. <laughs> it's it's meme, meme time. time. Listen, I, I look forward to this, okay? Because half the time I remember I find something like maybe a couple hours after we record, I play, I put it in the chat and I completely forget about it. Chat. This and then here cool. it is two weeks later. Oh, mine's not even a meme either. I just realized it's like yeah. uh, a throwback to the last time, like the second last time we streamed, because uh, that's how I stagger my content. Uh, so if you un uncover mine, uh, I dug oh. into uh, Enter's. Uh, oh, you vod found it, and I found the moment he adds, and you're in chat, by the way. Oh yeah, no, I remember being in chat for this. And he added Will Smith as the balloon. This is the original moment he did it. Lol, what? <laughs> Look, it's me. This is exactly what I wanted. Iconic. Iconic yeah. moment. This this was the building of our friendship. This, this here is the reason <laughs> Vizomatic exists. <laughs> this moment this moment is what put the whole group together this is it <laughs> why did I do this <laughs> uh, classic. <laughs> Don't worry, it's not for the audio. Oh god. Why? Why have I done this? 
And I, I, rem I, my favorite part of this whole bit with like Will Smith getting added in is that like it was specifically a different Will Smith Every each time, time. A different Will from Smith, from like yeah. a different movie or show. Yeah. <laughs> we started with Fresh Prince, and uh, it just it went downhill from there. Dude, I'm pretty sure I am Legend. Will Smith is there. You can see a little bit of my art there too, of the <laughs> the drawing ass that are to do of me, because. Like, that's what I was saying, is, like, I, I was really annoying. I was a really annoying Twitch chatter, which, was it even Twitch then? I think it was. Um, yeah, I know. It was, it was Twitch then, still. So. I, I was I think? really yeah. annoying. <laughs> so, like, if you look at the, it's hard to see on the screen there, but on the converse over there, I ha I asked for the a really small star. <laughs> like, and just, I, kept on, I kept on making them do like very specific details. Like all the Pokeballs I have on there are all Master Balls. I was like, I want a complete <laughs> thing. But like me asking for Will Smith started a whole trend where every single person that Enter drew with their Pokemon of choice also had a Will Smith. <laughs> like, <laughs> because of the bit. It's such a good bit. Um, so that's my meme. It's just a blast from the past. And I guess I'll jump over to, um, just the setup I'm, I have right now. I'll just open that up real quick. Um, F11 that shit. Uh, so this is the setup I have. You can see my garlic bread in the bottom left. That was my different, uh, <laughs> and my coffee cup <laughs> and my nasal spray and my N64, uh, Nintendo Switch online controller. But what you really see is the uh, Trillo that we have, uh, Motion being open, and the windows I have, and the camera that has my real-life self in there, uh, on there as well. And so it's all there. I can't believe you're doxing yourself again. Sorry, I fucked it again. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, so I'm really bad at doxing myself, but it's okay. So, anyways, that's that. No one's ever seen you and and your your flesh body never, before. Never, and I don't. I, I will never. Really, I will never reveal my true self. Of course, when I become a VTuber, I just made myself as a VTuber, the guy who made their username Mr. Chris Mad. Like <laughs> you know, of course. Yeah. <laughs> I I didn't even like try to make a dynamic character. Uh. <laughs> anyways, let's look at Twitches' memes. Are you ready, Twitches? I mean, you yeah. Know what I think they it's are. the you one know? that's above yours. Do you want to sure. do the first one or, or the second one? Uh, wait, hold on. The top one or the uh, there There's three that I've posted three. since last time. Oh, let's do that one then. Yeah. January 30th? That, this is the closest one to actually being a meme. The below average Joe? Foul top. Okay. <laughs> okay, are you ready? It's... All right, yeah, all right. I'm... I'm, I'm let, me, let me know. Foul. Let me make it big. All right. All right, chat. Let's let's make sure it's uh good. I need to make a close up to the video. Uh, oh, yeah. In search of the uh, I'll work on the camera while we're watching. Can we come up and have a look? Jesus Christ! <laughs> it's very good editing. <laughs> so good. <laughs> <laughs> they just did like a stupidly good job like matching up like the scale and everything yeah. in the perspective. <laughs> I love videos like this. Oh, I've got another video if uh if you didn't already post this one of your other memes. That's good. That's really good. Uh let's go look at your other memes. Uh the other memes. One one is a little bit longer, but I posted the shorter one first, and if you want more. All right, I've got the... Some Monster people Hunter in chat uh, may have seen this very recently. <laughs> this is a Monster Hunter Cat one. It's... Okay. It, I, this is a new sub sub uh, segment I like called uh, I Twitch's likes mocap stuff. Uh, we'll see if there's any other. <laughs> hey, I've got something for you for VTubing. <laughs> <laughs> I love how he's so good at it. <laughs> <laughs> he's so good at it. He's amazing. 
<laughs> Look at him go. <laughs> I want that job. How do I get that job? Seneca to be a mocap <laughs> person. <laughs> How do I make that me? And then the next one is uh, more Monster Hunter mocap goodness. Um, it's for like a very specific scene, and it's just hysterical seeing it in mocap form. Right, we're at zero zero <laughs> chat. Link up. Ready? All right. All right, zero zero three two one go. We're a React channel now, guys. What the fuck? <laughs> what the hell is that? <laughs> what the hell is that? Me, when I take my friends over to my grandma's house and we have to make toys. <laughs> <laughs> Like, I, I believe this man is, is a big old angry monkey. This reminds me of the Benderman Cumberbatch when he's the dragon or whatever. Yes! <laughs> Dude, that's it. <laughs> I love that they, like, <laughs> acted out, too. Like, the emotions are all there. Exactly! Like... <laughs> that's great. Did this guy need to go so hard for it? No, but... But he, he fucking did. sold it. <laughs> the sound of it too. Pretending to chew. <laughs> he doesn't have to do. That. That's great. <laughs> And th this is the part's actually crazy. Like the, yeah. like <laughs> the on hunter, yeah. on a on an actual last like ladder. Like that's great, dude. This makes me want to get into this crap because like, do it, oh learning yeah, everything I've learned so far. I did learn a bit about mocap. <laughs> this so is my cool. favorite part of the video. Sorry to like, you good? But just like, it's just it, it goes from like man acting like an actual ass monkey to just like. It's very common. It's like, yes, I'm a motion cap artist, uh, and you know, we have a lot of fun here. It's just like, <laughs> like yeah, the typical kind of like Japanese like sensibility. Yeah, it's so good. I love that. And it's just on top of footage of him. <laughs> and there's more like behind the scenes stuff. That's this is the important part though. But no, that's cool. I love mocap stuff, so I'm sharing the interest here. That's cool. Yeah. Um, it never stood. <laughs> I'm like, the next thing I need to learn for like blending and stuff, because I got, I figured out how to do models, and I figured out how to do rigging and stuff like that, is animations. Because yeah, I, I have like animation background. I've done animation shit before. Um, so the it, oh, the whole mocap thing would make that like so much more interesting if I could actually get that working. Because yeah. apparently you can like mocap in Blender with VR. Really? Yeah, like that makes you, sense. Actually, yeah, like there's a way to tunnel the movement data. Uh, uh. You, I can already do it with the hand tracker thing I have, apparently too. Uh, but it would just be hands. So it, to do a whole body thing, you would need that. That's cool. So I'll, I'll just turn that down. So that's cool though. And they're just like going into like the more of the behind the scenes stuff. I get it. You like Monster Hunter. I should put more Monster Hunter stuff in here. <laughs> That's what we definitely <laughs> do in the motion studio. Honestly, here. like as of a couple days ago, I'm just like I'm okay. I decide I'm really into Monster Hunter again. <laughs> yeah, that's 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 where I'm at. And well, then we'll definitely, uh, as a result of that, that was uh, that was linked. So that's so cool. All right. Is it gonna show? Yeah, I think that's it. Yeah, that's cool. I like that. Um, I love mocap stuff, and just Monster Hunter in general is really fun. They they have such like because part of, basically their thing is like their animations are necessary for you to like know when to attack and when to like yeah. do your move. Exactly, so it's very yeah. important for theirs. Um, uh, I think the... we have an ad break coming up in about ten seconds, so hey, maybe we'll just take a, audience, we'll, we'll we'll take a quick break. Go pee. Go pee. Go, go, go pet audience. your pets. I'll go, go look hydrate. At that other clip. 
Go um, stretch. Do all that good stuff. We'll we'll be back. Okay. Don't uh, worry. It'll pass. Um, right. Actually, speaking of that, I might actually go do that. <laughs> Twitch is going to pee. Is going to pee. Yeah. Take a shit, everybody. Go ahead. All right. I don't give a <laughs> shit. Do I look like I care? Um, where's that one? I just like the post. Uh, there's a few things on my Twitter I should share. Like, basically every like I just did <laughs> in the last, like, two weeks. Here we go. This is the one I'm looking for. I hope that music is enough to be exciting for you guys. How you guys, how you guys doing, chat? This is our chat moment. Let's put the music back on. How you chat doing? Ad break ends in 30 seconds. Remember, you guys can... Uh, I guess the only people that can hear me are the ones that donate. But if you uh, subscribe, I will put your model of choice in this little audience. Uh, feel free to sub. And if you do, uh, I will put your model of choice in here. So that you guys can uh, be part of the studio audience here. There was another program. And since everything's working so well, I could try to do it right now. Uh, let's see. I'm going to try it. We're going to see how it goes. On the bus heading home. There you go. Uh, I'm going to... So, at the detriment of the rest of the podcast, since it's been going so well, I'm going to try to ruin it. Um, <laughs> because I have this other idea that I was trying to do, but because of all the lag we've been having, uh, I couldn't do it. So, now I'm going to try to do it. We're going to see how it goes. Live on twitch.tv. Ruining. So chat, I'm going to ruin it. <laughs> Uh, ad. Uh, wh what would it be considered? Not website. It would be considered a window capture. Uh, standby chat. Uh, let's go with that. Alright, enable. And then crop. Oh no! And then scale. Chat, can you, uh, I, I'm not trying to bait engagement, but can you guys chat real quick? <laughs> Just real quick. Can you guys start talking? Thanks, chat. Yeah, keep chatting, guys. What the hell is that? Why does it have all that? <laughs> What the fuck is that? All right, uh, just adjusting it. Hang on, threshold working. Oh, it's not threshold. Uh, it's like right. Where is it? There's a sweet spot I found earlier. So chat is now in the, the ch in the audience. And uh, let's look at my processing power right now. Good news, guys. We're at forty-five percent. This is great. So I can do this bit. So chat, you're in the audience. There you go. Yeah, I keep on forgetting to do this, but it's like since we've had so many other problems, I didn't have time. Uh, no. <laughs> no politics. <laughs> well, I love bits. I gotta have something that like shows like who's what. Uh, I don't know how you guys are supposed to change the avatars. I think the little chat bot comes up every once in a while like the stream avatars bot and he tells you like where you can go um but yeah i was thinking that we could also put that like on the desk but like we already have a chat right below us but i thought this would be a cool like standby screen of like the chat actually being able to talk how does this work so there you go uh so stream avatars is a program and then you can pick uh, your character. I forget, like, what website you have to go to for your personal character, but each chat room has one. And then you can make your character. I chose, like, Animal Crossing and, like, the default box one, I think. And you can make up your own character and they can walk on screen. But there's, like, tons of different packs to have, like, Mario characters to, like, Final Fantasy characters. Like, whatever. Um, and you can have it so that they're static, like, they're always there. Um, or you can have it where they appear after they say something. 
But now that it's in the program, it's a window that's captured, green screened, and then placed into the 3D space. Uh, and then I just magically have them like on the borders of where they're walking. So that's how it works. So I'm I'm constantly like <laughs> I love doing this. I, I don't know if people have noticed, but I love doing this. <laughs> this is my favorite <laughs> shit to work on. Um I wanna push the envelope of streaming and I don't want to just stream games. Like I feel like um I think I've emphasized it enough, but there's like so much that's capable out there for streaming. Um like there's a lot of stuff people can do and it doesn't have to just be gaming. Uh, so this is just me, like, adding my little part of the fold. Um, and all of this stuff is free, rel relatively. Like, the games cost a little bit. Like, the stream avatar costs a little bit. Um, to make the 3D model, you don't have to make the 3D model. You just have to have a webcam. Twitch is just has a fucking webcam from when he was 16 years old. I mean, it's all good. Like, I was older than that. <laughs> seven, 17. Oh, I was older than that. 40, 46. Ooh. <laughs> 30. <laughs> um, Warmer. <laughs> yeah. Also, I totally fucked yeah. up the Banner Butter logo, but I only wanted to tell everybody um, directly. But I'm going to make a new model because I made the Banner Butter logo the wrong way. Um, <laughs> the main one that's on the screen right now. I fucked it up. It goes in the wrong way. But that's okay. It looks cool still. Um, yeah. And that with the V, like it shapes perfectly with the V. I thought that was kind of sick. So that's cool. But yeah. Uh, now we have these little close-ups. Our desks are getting better. We need to add Godzilla right there. <laughs> Wait, this guy. Oh yeah, where, where did Godzilla go? Angle. <laughs> that's a cute little angle. Let me bring in everything. Hold on, I'll bring in stuff. There's a the Pikmin. He's falling off the desk. There, there. Oh, there he is. There he is. This is kind of cute. Hey, Godzilla. I was gonna animate Godzilla, but. Uh, he's starting to get weird. <laughs> so I was just like, I'll just make a model. <laughs> he's all big. I'll put him over here. This, this program, you literally can get obsessed with this program. I just fuck around with this program for like two hours every once in a while. Um, and again, you guys can, uh, work with the UFO. Once again, uh, where's that UFO? I should get a angle so the UFO can get in there. So if you guys do like U exclamation point UFO and then a letter uh, that has to do with a direction, so like east, yeah, you guys can mess it around. Is this really a podcast? <laughs> to like, I just think about it. Like, is this really a podcast? Does it have it's to be a talk show? Yeah, I guess podcast. It's more like, a like talk what's show. what's the difference here? It's it's I don't know. I guess podcast is primarily meant for audio medium, but. It's definitely yeah. I'm not even posting on fucking Spotify. No. Right so it's a it's a thing. Banner Brothers is a thing. <laughs> Anyways, it's so a I thing. found the I found the video that uh, your video reminded me of that just happened recently. So I'm gonna go to uh, computers. This video. Uh, turn off the music for a sec. Oh, I have to link it to you though, so you have it. Oh my god. Uh, where's Twitches? I'll put it in meme chat. Here you go. Memes. Uh, All right. Uh, zero, zero, when you're ready. All right. I'm ready. Hell yeah. <laughs> I love this stuff. People putting cats in the fucking random video games and shit like that. I fucking love this shit. This is my brain but I love this crap. I want to edit something like this. I... I love this. I'm, like, trying to think... <laughs> I love I'm this. trying to think of how long it would have taken to mask all of these video clips. Well, so, like, there like, is, like... Like, I use it's... Adobe After Effects a lot, and masking has gotten way easier. There's rotoscope yeah, I... painting and shit like that. This makes it so easy. Uh, but okay. then, th this is clearly a free cam in Mario... Uh, galaxy, yeah, and then some th some clever like uh, blendering. I think like they use Blender for some of this. Oh yeah, yeah. I you can kind of see That's where weird. some of the compositing is. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. It's beautiful. I love the I'm beginning like. What the? 
<laughs> There's something so creative about like having the cat react to things in the game. It's just so funny to me. I fucking yeah. love that shit. Um, but yeah, there's been a lot of uh, tweets I've done recently that, like, let's just look at my Twitter, <laughs> guys. We're gonna <laughs> look at my Twitter. Um, where's the other one? This is uh, Chris's uh, likes on Twitter uh, segment. <laughs> Yo, guys. Well, this is kind of cool. I mean, like, let's just keep this ball rolling. This is just this will be quick. This is just like, oh, cool. Um, someone's making The Sims effectively but better. Uh, and it's called Para Lives. Oh, like Paradise. Well, that's actually kind of a. I like the the uh, coloring. It's almost, got, on it's that. almost got like a Life is Strange kind of thing going to it. Mm-hmm. Um, but like textures you, are like really painterly. Yeah. So like you get a job, you know, it's it's basically The Sims, but a little bit more personal. It looks like with some more personal interactions. Uh, and like doing activities together is what grows like your friendship and whatnot and that's what gets you connections and what gets you better jobs and stuff like this mm -hmm. uh, so it just looks like a, a a little bit more of a personal sims which i i appreciate i, I love the sims so yeah i'd like to see more of that one um i don't know if the state of play even happened did the state of play happen it did. It did. did it and there the was a second one, which I didn't get to see the second one yet. Uh, was it good? Oh, well, there's some decent stuff in the state of play. I mean, Who's it's, in our it's, India it's a state of play. <laughs> Hold on. I, I, I literally had this, uh, had it, everything pulled up from it. Uh, no, that's all this, the rebirth stuff. Oh, Chris, there's uh -huh. Death Stranding 2 stuff in it. Oh, yeah, for sure. Yeah, Death Stranding 2 was a big one for me. We can look at yeah. a clip of that. Uh... This uh, oh yeah, now. that was and the I can't remember. Did you actually end up watching it or just what, saw it, stuff after the fact? What's that? The the Death Stranding thing? Oh, oh yeah, for or the state of play in general. Yeah, I watched the state of play. I don't know if I watched like every single thing about it, but I definitely watched the Death Stranding stuff. Can uh, can can we go back and watch that uh, Dave the Diver trailer again? Uh, fuck. <laughs> I know exactly what you're talking about. I mean, oh yeah, you've seen it. We don't need to talk about it, but like, I didn't. I, it's when did, weird. This happens that... like right after we recorded. Yeah. It right. Was. Yeah. And like, I swear, like Dave the Diver is like really trying to get me to play it, because they kept because the the last uh, update thing that they had is like very me, and then this, <laughs> like, oh my god. And I'm at seven seconds already. All right. Dave the Diver. So what is this game? They're like deep sea fishing and stuff. It, I know it, it had looks like good 2D, 3D. Yeah, like, it was kind of like, yeah. So like I've heard really good things about it. <clears throat> yeah. Oh my God. Something is coming. Let's just put <laughs> fucking Godzilla in everything. <laughs> Toho's really good, trying dude. to milk me for every single ounce of my money that I don't have. Hey, you like Godzilla, right? <laughs> <laughs> Do I like Godzilla? <laughs> I don't dude, know if I've ever I talked about this, but... uh, <laughs> Dave the Diver. I like that that's it. That's all they showed. Yeah, I mean, that's that's all they need to show. And then we we bought the DLC for the Minecraft Godzilla. That'll probably be a series. Um, yeah. I don't really want to announce the other big... Like, that's always a problem with, like, announcing a project and stuff like that, because we have other big ideas uh, that we want to do, but I don't want to announce it because it's more of a surprise if it, when it comes out. Yeah, um, it's... Or at least when we're kind of like further into the pipeline with it, like yeah, I, like I mean, when I, I know it's. Happening, I, I'm, ex no, I'm, I'm actually really excited for the next one. Actually, hold on. Yeah, a lot of these projects have been pretty good. Um, it's honestly like it's been very refreshing. It's kind of been like a, a whole nostalgia journey for me. These last like this last year has been a lot of like looking back. Um, like the Minecraft project alone was a big one. 
and that kind of like got me in that mindset and then like us doing banner buddies again and like it's like putting me like yeah. creatively back to where i was like 10 years ago and i think that's what gave me the energy to do this whole vtuber thing because i like legitimately was like man i used to be fucking creative what what happened <laughs> what, <laughs> what happened um but being creative and still like trying to consider the fact of like, well, we want to grow a little bit. Uh, yeah. Like I, I really do want to put a lot of heart into these projects and like make meaningful projects as we go forward. And this next one should be pretty good. Um, I'm just, it's just more, it's still a, more of a personal journey, but it's still uh, one to look at. Yeah. No, there's, I mean, we have people that will definitely appreciate it. Like even yeah. it's, it's not just, it's one of those things like it's for us, but it's not just for us, but like, it's for us. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Just you know. a, like uh, a lot of the projects for this year have, uh, for me personally, been like a getting back to your roots. And I think as we like, we'll roll after May, uh, a lot of it will be like, um, okay, now let's build an image off of this. Cause I think the, the big thing, ironically, that Vismatic has been lacking forever is an image, you know, like what we are, you know, mm -hmm. like we, we have such a dynamic cast and like I allow so many projects to go through, like there's not really like a, this is us, you know, like when you think of us, you think of, you know, um, and I really want to push that point forward. Um, a lot of it's going to be yeah. around, um, those kind of games where like we collectively all play together, but also like I really I really like messing with games. Uh, there's another project you don't know about that's also equally as big, if not bigger. Um, yeah, that you, is you've about been, you've us. Been teasing you, something. You're gonna be so excited about that one. I can't <laughs> wait. I cannot wait. You what? You waved it in front of my face, and then you're like, yep. mm, no, yep. I like that one's really fun. That one's gotta stay in the in the shush shush. That might even be like. Um, announced on our anniversary that that's how big i think it is uh yeah but it takes a lot of work a lot of artwork too um but look forward to that chat there's more teasers more teasers uh what were we i feel like there was something else i wanted to show from my twitter i'm, I'm literally scrolling twitter this is a bad host uh oh <laughs> this is this isn't like a meme but uh and you don't even have to link for this one uh Fucking Twitch Play Pokemon is ten years old. What? Twitch Play Pokemon, the Helix thing, Ooh. just turned ten years old, and that makes me feel That's... so fucking old, dude. Like what the yeah. hell? <laughs> what the actual hell? Like what the That's fuck? That's just this crazy, dude. I don't, I don't like that. Oh, here's one. Oh, uh, I put. Look at my webcam thing. Uh, I put Billy Hatcher on my phone. <laughs> oh my god! And it works. <laughs> it's great. <laughs> uh, it's great. I added a controller after, but <laughs> it's, it works. I love it. <laughs> Just a little Billy Hatcher I can carry around. Dude, little that's guy. Yeah. <laughs> honestly, definitive way to play <laughs> to put Billy Hatcher on your little phone. That's I that's one of those GameCube games I never played, but I wanted to. Dude, it's just, that's so your vibe. That game is very much your vibe. I know. I I feel like You'll it would be Go live. My vibe. Go live, Wimp. You won't go live. <laughs> go. <laughs> go live. Go live. Go live. Go live. Go live. Uh, Can't hear you guys. Damn. <laughs> All right. So yeah, was there anything else out of state of play that you want to bring up? Uh, oh, hold on. Let me let me skim. Chat, I'll dance for you. Uh, let's see. I mean, there's stuff that I would go over if I played it. Like they shadow dropped a Silent Hill game for free, I guess. Yeah, that was the fun. thing. Yeah, like I, I guess I it's kind PS5. of like a. Yeah. Uh, I haven't. I downloaded it. I haven't had time to play it yet, but uh. Go live. Oh, what was the other thing? Hey, Shadow is getting his time in the sun again. You know. Oh yeah. We had the year yeah, of Luigi, and it's dude. it's time for the year of Shadow. We're we're dude, Sonic the Hedgehog so three. I'm pulling that up. Sonic. Sonic and Shadow Generations. Dude, Sonic and like Shadow. It's, it's is about their babies canon. together. <laughs> dude, it's officially canon. Sonic and Shadow. Is it? I'm 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 kind of like. 
Are they going to do a classic shadow thing, or is it just... Well, they showed a little bit. I'm linking you the video. Because it, it seems like it's just kind of like the newer gameplay for, for Shadow, but... A little bit. I think it's like both. It's kind of like a blend. Like, clearly the gameplay is a little different looking. I don't think mm -hmm. Shadow will ever have 2D. Um, Sonic has like both. Mm -hmm. Like, he'll go 2D and 3D, and then classic Sonic is always 2D. Because, like, I'd, I'd love to see, like, Shadow designed in, like, the classic style. You know? Yeah. And I love it. It's literally the Sonic Adventure 2 battle yeah, thing sick. right there. That was so sick. And up there, like, literally. That's I, I'm not going to lie. That kind of got me. I was like, oh, my God. <laughs> That's a project that, like, I'll, I'll, like, I'll even spoil it because it's been around for so long. But we really want to do Sonic Adventure 2 battle. But there's two cast, and then we all meet as six people at the end. Um, oh, yeah. I thought that'd be really sick. Apparently, there's, like, a bunch of mods of Sonic Adventure 2, and I, that's what I'm looking into right now. Um, but, dude, against fucking the perfect life form or whatever the fuck, that's sick. Yeah. There, God, that's... Yeah, no, I, I actually had an idea. I don't know if I ever have a brought it up yet, but mm -hmm. that would be... I don't know. I'm not, I'm not going to bring it up now because it's it's too good of an idea to just kind of, like, blurt out, I think. But if, do if all there the is Sonic a Sonic games. Adventure thing... <laughs> We're this, 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 this is this is gonna this is gonna be off stream. Don't, don't let me Dude, forget to, to tell you about this. Chat, this is big. Uh, this is big. Uh, to talk about projects that are coming out. Um, because I I've I've been thinking of that like we should actually make the podcast also like a statement about what what's going on in Vizmatic that we do have. Yeah, talk yeah. About everything that we haven't done. That's <laughs> that. Well, we should probably talk about what we have. Um, uh, here let me look. Uh, on our channel right now. We've released uh, Versus. So I brought Versus back. Just randomly, Versus is back. Uh, the first, like, this new iteration of Versus is more like what you've seen a lot of streamers start doing, where, like, two streamers get together. And then these two streamers will each pick a list of games. And the first to X amount of points wins the, like, uh, challenge or whatever. So... I did that with Dag for fun. He picked three games, I picked three games, and we tried to see who's better as a gamer. So you both bring your games together to it. So I want to do that with more people. Um, it shouldn't ju be just me, but I'll probably host a lot of them. Where I'm versus other people as gamers. Uh, I'll I'll jump into that. I'll jump yeah. into that. Well. But it's like you could have <laughs> anything from like Smash Brothers to like we the one that. Uh, just came out was Marvel Snap, uh, but we did like uh, Super Video yeah. Golf. So it's like it's not it's not just fighting games. It is not just like a, a Mario Party is one I want to do. Like do a Mario Party match, and then, oh like, god, and maybe we'll do just the mini game <laughs> mode or something like that. Who's the better mini game player? And we'll do like the yeah. like one that like is fair, not like one that's on Parsec. Um, we did a uh, we me and Enter have been doing a ton of indies together. We did a uh, the buckshot roulette the meme game that's been out of course uh me and midnight uh finishing up pikmin do the lethal company videos dude guys check out check out this thumbnail man look at that look at that thumbnail man what the look at that dude i've been so this look is like part that. of my blender experiencing is that i'm like i've been making these sick ass thumbnails um for like lethal company as a good example there can i zoom in on that let's get a zoom in on that chat look at look at look at that yeah that's uh, another new year's resolution of mine is like get better at thumbnails <laughs> and make them <laughs> um which comes and goes <laughs> it comes and goes guys but we're we're getting better we're getting better uh and then enters hosting ghost trick which is another series that like he brought back uh me and enter have been talking a lot about like let's finish like old stuff that'd be another good thing for this year it's just like finishing old projects or whatever especially because so many are being remade another one i can just put out there that hasn't been released yet i just edited the first episode is persona 3 which fun fact persona 3 was our first sit down like proper sit down like Technically, GoldenEye was our first sit-down, but we called it sit-in, and it was a totally different show. <laughs> like, not... Oh, yeah, that was the whole thing. <laughs> yeah, because the idea of sit-in was the joke that everyone was in the same room and we were faking it. 
Oh. Uh, yeah. But then Sit Down was the actual, like, we play through a game. And we did our first episode of that uh, in Persona uh, 3. And since Edo is part of the channel again, uh, it's me, Edo, and Rebecca. And so we're going through it again. We're not playing the whole damn thing, though, because someone's going to be like, are you really going to do episode 367 of Persona 3? No. Um, so we have, like, an arbitrary stopping point, And then once we do that, we're done. Like, it's just a nice little homage uh, to the fact that we did Persona 3. Because we can't afford the time to do <laughs> 600 episodes of fucking Persona 3. It doesn't make any sense for the channel. Um, or are you? Uh, <laughs> yeah. So that's that's, coming. that's a surprise, guys. Yeah, <laughs> full full playthrough of Persona 3. Preload. 46 <laughs> episodes of fucking Persona 3. Uh, we're going to have more episodes than there are days in the game. <laughs> Just. <laughs> what the um, yeah, no thanks. So, <laughs> uh, so look forward to all those projects. Uh, but we have all kinds of stuff coming up. Uh, the the two big projects, and then the Minecraft one. I guess I could talk about, like the like we definitely want to do Minecraft Windows versions, which would include the Godzilla one. <laughs> like, there's all kinds of shit I want to do, um, and a lot of like uh, add two player to games that shouldn't have two player are always ones that I'm looking at. And then, like, indies of games that look like old Nintendo games and stuff like that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very excited about that. Uh, Twitches, what are you doing for the channel? What am I doing for this channel? Banner buddies. <laughs> oh, <okay. laughs> well, no, we there, there there is some other stuff in the works, but we we literally we were just like, okay, we're not gonna yeah. bring it up yet. I, I can't say yeah. what we're what we're doing yet. Like, as far as like coming out in the near future, I don't. Yeah, I've been appreciating right. like Enter's like new energy with it too. Enter's been like really going at it. Oh, that's another one I can uh, say is coming out very soon is Tekken. Uh, Enter showed me Tekken. I don't know a thing about Tekken. <laughs> during Not during the last Banner Buddies episode. <laughs> oh yeah, he was like emphasizing the Literally. character stuff too. But like he actually just sat me down, and there's a whole synopsis of the other seven Tekken games, and we watched all that, and then we played all of Tekken Eight. Like the whole story, mm. and then uh, he made every Vizno. So <laughs> like it's a that's gonna be a fun fun one, because um, it's just me and Enter's commentary while we play a, a weird Tekken is basically Kingdom Hearts, just to put it out there, guys. Like Final Fantasy <laughs> level of storytelling in that shit. It's funny, I actually. Really oh yeah, it. it's it's buck wild. It's so funny. I mean, how how many people got dropped into volcanoes? Repeatedly. Yeah, that was, <laughs> I was like, That's... all I know about Tekken is that everyone keeps on throwing each other in the, in the fucking volcanoes all the time. <laughs> like they keep on taking Kirby turns. gets thrown into a volcano at one yeah. point. <laughs> I didn't realize how big of a meme that was when the Smash Bros. video came out about it. That I didn't oh, realize yeah. how much of a bit <laughs> that was. Like, <laughs> uh, dude, it's 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 a a story about bad fathers and throwing people into volcanoes that's that's about that's that's about all i really know about second story you know like that would be i wonder if that'd be like a different show format and maybe we would do it like in a space like this with the like the banner buddies like concept but like i kind of want to do like interesting because we've talked about before like doing uh shared watches of shows like we did a uh we never released it but uh too quiet for comfort as one example, yeah. Uh, like I'd like to do commentary like this, like we're in this setting, but actual like full on reacts. I don't even know if that would be a, like a good Visomatic main channel thing. Like maybe that would be on Visomatic Live or something like that. Um, but just like fun little commentaries while we watch. Um, Chad, are you interested in something like that? Like where we like watch. Uh, my my big thing would obviously be VGA. We'd watch AVG. Like all the way through, we could do. Oh yeah. Uh, what made me think about this is like we could do all the Smash character reveals, like from the start, like when they introduced <laughs> Sonic or some shit, like way back, and just watch all of them in tandem with each other. Oh, I thought that'd man. be cool. Yeah. And just do like commentaries while we do that. Is that interesting? I don't know. I, I, that that was a pipe. What What if interview. we just we'll, we'll just go react, to Andy? People like it. Yeah, people, well, that's what I'm saying. Like, but it, it, like, it's almost like not a main channel thing for me. 
Like reacting no, no. is such a weird. Like the fact that we react on the podcast is weird. Yeah. For me. <laughs> we'll we'll yeah. have a second channel for like non gaming content. Yeah. <laughs> Rather than the second channel being the gaming content one. Yeah, right. <laughs> for steady yeah. income, like yeah, we do, we do everything wrong. <laughs> we do everything wrong. Everyone's supposed to go. Get, I'm all be, about it. I'm all about it. Everyone's supposed to have a million subs and then build a channel together. Like that's what you're supposed to. <laughs> like we're all supposed yeah. to like become our own big creators and then make a group. Um, we're actually all supposed to be friends before we make the group. <laughs> I just asked a bunch of random people on the internet, "You want to, you want to be in this channel with me?" And then they all said yes, and then they stayed for ten years. <laughs> like <laughs> legit, though. Like out of everybody, yeah. Twitch is like the only person I kind of like knew. <laughs> and even that, like we just yeah, we just each other's it, internet. You, you just kind of threw kind of uh, threw it into the wind and just kind of. <laughs> It's like, all right, all right, I, we got a few. I can't got believe a few. it. We got I can't a few. believe it. Yeah, I can't believe No one, uh, like, low bar, but no one ever said no. I've never gotten a no. Yeah. No one's ever said no to me. Um, which is why I also looked at the list of back on the drive. This Right in the same spot with the uh, uh, message statement, I looked at the list of people that are supposed to join Viznomatic. And I'm not gonna leak this one. I'm not showing it, but <laughs> it has the people you were supposed to invite. Yeah, that's right. And the people and I, I never did. <laughs> and you never did. And those people I are still did. out there. Some I don't know if they all like make stuff anymore. Um, I'm gonna private message you this one just because of how important it is. Where is Twitch's? I don't know if this if you can open that. Uh, but if you can, that's fine. Uh, yeah, but I'm... like, there were other members that were oh, supposed to request join. The access. That's how secret it is. Oh, oh, I just got all the links. Oh, it's beeping at me. Oh, cool doxing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you can be a viewer. There you go. You're in. Refresh. Oh yeah. Isn't that awkward? <laughs> Man, yeah. Dude. And it's funny, like, that cast, of those cast members, half of them are still with us. I'll say who's still here, because obviously they're still here. Uh, but it's Edo, yeah. Enter, Dag, and Twitches, obviously, and me. Um, yeah. But the other half is just, like, things change, life change, or, like, we never ask them. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I Like, uh, one that's on here that I will just, like, call out was, like, Rizu. Like, literally the second week, uh, Rizu was in... Uh, Vizomatic, Rizu kind of, like, came to me and said, like, I don't really like gaming. <laughs> and, <laughs> and, like, and, like, and you guys are doing a lot of Let's Plays, so I just don't think it's going to work. And I'm like, that's fair. <laughs> like, we we weren't going to originally be predominantly gaming. It was supposed to be a multimedia thing. Like, we were going to yeah. do music. We were going to do art. We were going to do all of it. Um, but we... <laughs> we, we really like doing let's plays it was the way the channel was going it's what i like to edit it was what i like to do uh so rizu bowed out but rizu is still very very much a good friend i mean rizu made the intro for this so we're still very good friends um but i just thought it was funny <laughs> that like this is so funny to me but it, i just i'm just so happy that like we made it 10 years in general though that like it's still yeah. going um what it looks like today is not what it looked like back then and all I want is like to keep on producing a better um, production quality behind everything that we do. Like that's all I'm aiming for these days. It's just keep on yeah. making stuff look better. Uh, which, how do you guys like the podcast, huh? Can we get some chat integration here, <laughs> chat? Huh? What do you think? Yeah, let's look at the audience. What do you guys think? What do you, th what do you think about that? Audience, what do you think? <laughs> let's hear ya. Wait, there's a podcast? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> <So>. <laughs> The hell? Chat, what do you think? Chat, what the hell? Come on. Come on. Come on, Come on chat. Man. What the hell? Who's the planet over there? <laughs> Why are you a planet, Lord Enigma? <laughs> it's just an entire ass planet. Why are you? A, you're a little guy with a planet on his back. I don't understand <laughs> you made that and why you made that. What the fuck? Oh, this thing did it again. There we go. 
There's like a weird thing that happens. Whoa, starting soon. There we go. Like where the camera like gets stuck or something. I think it's hitting something. And it like stops midway before it gets yeah. it. Yeah. Uh, I don't know how this works. <laughs> oh, uh, God. What else is happening in gaming news before I consider wrapping us up? Uh, Mario is back. <laughs> no, he's not. Dude, I <laughs> make the Switch 2 come out already. Fuck. Just so people stop talking about it. Oh, yeah. There's more more rumors. I mean, they're slightly more substantiated rumors this time, it sounds like. Well, so the fact but, that there was no I mean, it's February still vague. Direct, it's right? just, yeah, like it was, uh, there was like a, what was it? A, a poll or something, or why am I blanking on the name of it? Survey. It was, it was right. a GDC survey, apparently. And mm -hmm. one of the questions is like, what are you currently developing for? And one of them was like the Nintendo Switch successor. And there's like, I don't know, like 8% of people that polled were doing that. But like, yeah. that could still just mean just like, you know, we're just making it, but it's not. We're really making enough. it and then hopefully it'll come out on that. Like that's, it could just mean that. But yeah, you know. What do you think it would look like? Because personally, I think they should just make it the uh, legitimately like the switch 2 but however every time they do that like they made the wii u it was like the worst the system they ever made financially i like the wii u i think we're all we i did apologists too. in the group but like that was a I'm, good console but I'm like a, a switch wii u 2, apologist <laughs> the switch 2 would probably fail right i mean like, unless it's just, a, just... substantially different right yeah, I it's I I I I I don't think it's like they would end and necessarily just like flop because of what it is, but like yeah. It's hard to say because Nintendo really likes their innovation, but yeah. they I don't think they're going to want to like stray too far from what they have with the Switch yeah, because it's doing so well. It's working. You know, so, well. so it's yeah. you know, I I have a feeling there's going to be some sort of uh curveball with it but i i imagine it'll be some it'll still kind of be portable hybrid to some extent that's 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 all i can say because it'd be it'd be strange for them to switch away from that because they spent so much time and energy kind of like merging kind of their their handheld market and their console market you know yeah the only thing i can like like if they literally do make like some sort of like hinging two screen switch that'd be sick um yeah honestly like with the i i sort of picture of it but i have the flip phone um if nintendo actually like adopted that and they actually it's just that's expensive right now like in terms of like tech right now this the bending screen because imagine the phone or imagine the switch unfolds and it's the size of like the samsung galaxy fold but then has the controllers so it's a really big screen and when you close it there's another screen <laughs> so you can have either or like they could do shit like that um oh yeah but, yeah but i don't think nintendo would go that far like and the more i think about it like i don't pick my switch up i do put it on the on the tv and play it on the tv i don't find myself that often actually like grabbing the little guy and working it there um didn't they pat F another funny game? enough it's yeah. it's the opposite for me like i i play a lot more in handheld like i could I, I very much could justify getting like it, uh, OLED switch, honestly. Like it's yeah. like that. Maybe that's how often I, I use it. Because I handheld. didn't get an OLED. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I mean, I got mine literally at launch. Like I, I yeah, have a too. day one switch. Yeah, dude. It is. It, I was selling it is them. The first I was selling them, in... and there was two left, and I was like, oh shit, let's go. Dude. <laughs> I'll take one. Hell yeah. Oh, Ash was so happy that day. That was so sick. Oh man. And yeah. the, you know what the first thing she did? She opened up the first game we got and put it in her mouth. And she's like, it is disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> of course, yeah. Yeah. I remember that whole thing. Is that still a thing? Probably. Yeah, they are. It probably oh, is. I tried it just last week. <laughs> I, you know, I, I just do it for work. You know, just it's, it's you it's, know, just for customers. Testing, no, I, okay. I, yeah, it's product testing product for, the, for the customers. <laughs> Come on, guys. <laughs> for real. Jeez. Um, but I think, like, 
they they can't stray too far from the design, but didn't they uh, patent a switch controller that could like bend, like it could have a hinge, so that they were better gripping. So like yeah, the thumb platform kind of like goes up a little bit. Um, but if that hinges, that's what makes me think that like maybe the screen hinges. That's where my thought process came from. That because. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just giving you more screen real estate is obviously the big problem, but once you have a set size for the controllers, you can't make the screen that much more bigger. It just fundamentally, yeah. like, gets awkward at a point. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. Like, it's it just not going to be doable. But, I mean, we're only probably five years from proper, like, roll-up screen technology. But in oh, the same yeah. time... Yeah. We've got stuff like the Apple AR shit. You know, that shit you put on the goggles and you're like, um, <laughs> I'm in my computer. Oh, yeah. I, act I actually tried the, uh, not too long ago, like a month ago or so, I, I got to try out one of the, the Windows uh, uh, AR stuff. Yeah. Which is, it was just kind of wild. It's, it's interesting. Like, I mean, it's, it's gimmicky and it was like the first model of it. Yeah. Or, yeah, the first version of it, basically. So, like, there wasn't a lot for it because, like, stuff... The stuff that is coming out for it, which isn't a lot to begin with... Yeah, like, is a is, problem. Yeah, it's it's on the newer things. That's kind of the thing, the dangerous part about getting on the ground level with stuff. But, yeah, you know, it, it was interesting, though. So, yeah. Yeah, it's so funny. Like, all this tech comes out. Like, for example, like, the hand tracking thing I have. Uh, this came out to, like, uh, free use your computer with your hands. Like, that's what it came out for. But the software mm -hmm. doesn't work for that anymore. Yeah. So yeah. <laughs> it became like a VTuber's life dream. Uh, I just recently saw someone like uh, they used a neural link computer system just so they could move their cat ears in VR chat. <laughs> like, oh, <God. laughs> like, this tech is just like sitting out there and it works and people just don't use it for the way it was like intended. Um, but I actually do think that like AR will be real. Uh, if you're giving me AR, it better have tabletop software coming with it. No, like, for real. Like, imagine you're doing, like, D&D, &D, but you actually see all your stats, like, in your HUD of your life. You know, shit like that. It'd be sick. Or, It'd like, be pretty sick. Just Google Maps. Um, I saw someone <laughs> see a post about that, because someone is, like, walking around with Apple Vision on their face and walking through town and shit like that. And they're like, I see that the demographic for Apple Vision Pro is for people that have object permeance issues <laughs> like like that don't understand like where things are <laughs> at all it's for them but seriously like uh marquis the guy who always just like reviews for most phones and shit like that uh i used to watch him a lot when i sold phones i don't do that anymore but like uh he did a great review about the apple vision pro because i'm just more curious than anything else because it is just new technology that's pushing the envelope and i appreciate that um and he said, like, the biggest issue that it has just out the gate is that there's no shared experience. That being said, it's a $4,000 headset, so no one's going to, like, who all, like who are you going to know that also has one? Like, when you buy one, <laughs> you're like, oh, did you also get the, <laughs> the $4,000 yeah. Apple Vision Pro specifically when you don't even have an iPhone? You know, <laughs> like, <laughs> like, no one's going to buy it together, but the the shared experience that like even vr has alone is super cool um like i still remember our first experiences with like vr chat and being able to like walk up to michelle and like we do patty cake and shit like that that shit's crazy like that's yeah. actually crazy that that just like works naturally it makes me want to do more vr stuff in general too um but it can get tiring and it's still cumbersome and it's a process to set up and, like, it's got to get to, a, like, a technology point where you put it on, it's like glasses. Like, you just put on a pair of glasses, and you're in. And we're just not there yet. Yeah. Like, uh, not with, like, extra hardware and crap like that. And then you got to think about, like, the demographic. Like, you and me would figure that out, but could your mom? <laughs> could, <laughs> could your mom figure that out? Probably not. Also, I could do this with my goggles the whole time, but I never did it. <laughs> you, you you you're waiting for the VR in. Yeah, to... I'm waiting. <laughs> yeah. So let me talk about let me talk about VR. VR. <laughs> Dude, the goggles being toggleable was a big thing. <laughs> like I'm like I need these toggleable. I don't know how you do it. Just make it happen. 
<laughs> sick. Very sick. Um, I've got to work on this model a little bit more, too. It's supposed to have, like, uh, different expressions. Like, joy, anger, sadness. It's supposed to have all those. But uh, I was like, I got to get this done. <laughs> I got to get it. I do the <laughs> podcast. It's for the podcast. Um, I think after this one, now that it works, and I see that it works, because <laughs> that was my biggest fear, was that I put in all this work for this podcast, and it, we just had to can it because I was pushing it too far. Like, we got to go back to webcams. Um, but now that I see that it works, um, I think I'm going to pause on, like, development stuff. And I might work on the studio itself. Like, there maybe I'll make a whole new studio, like, from the ground up and literally make the whole thing. But aside from that, I don't think we're going to have a lot of development on that side. I think we'll now actually, like, start developing host. Because our pool of host, and that's part of why, like, it's just me and Twitch is, is because I don't have every Vizno ready to go to jump in here. Um, yeah. Like, for each person, I want to take a lot of time to let them each, like, okay, do you want to be a PNG tuber? Do you want to have your webcam? How do you want to do it? And then we work on a process and then put them in. So it's been a very slow roll for that. and But now we're about... This this podcast alone has made me confident that like it can happen. Like Now we can actually move forward on this stuff. And who knows, by the end of it, we're all probably going to be VTubers. <laughs> like, let's be real. Uh, it may happen. <laughs> it's an infection, I tell you. Twitch is... If you were a VTuber model, what would you be? What would I be? I was thinking... I like, mean, it... Like honestly, it's kind of what I thought. I've I've thought about it. Would you be? I your don't know. Like wall? maybe go. That, that like literally, I was gonna say like if I like would I go back to my roots and become a narwhal again? Like. <laughs> would that that wouldn't make you a scaly or a furry? What would that make you like a fishy? Like what is that? <laughs> what is that? What do they call whales? They're mammals technically. So is that a furry? Is there, is there <laughs> Does whales? that count as a furry? He's just a mobile suit. Now to kind be of fair. Fuzzy. A, a slippery, mech, <laughs> like a mobile suit or a mech or something, really works because there's no mouth. So like you could yeah. just be a dude in a suit and that would that would work. But I do kind like, of like the whole point of the podcast is where like you show up any way you want. But I mean, it's just yeah. so enticing. Look at this. <laughs> Look at it. It's like, so like honestly, I do. I, I I do dig like the low poly thing. Hell yeah. Like I I I I, I think that'd be a fun direction to go with it. But like. If if you really want to go to the deep deep Twitch's lore that literally no one knows oh, about no. before me, like but me but like like robot technically is like the first incarnation of Twitch's back when I did sprites comic sprite comics like oh, hell yeah. way back in the day, like it was yeah it, it was it was like a Mega Man sprite rip like uh edit mm. or something like that. So technically, ro technically speaking, robot like is uh, <laughs> that, that is the earliest version of Twitch's. Chat, I, what do you think? I'm curious if I still have those sprites somewhere. They, I must, I must have them somewhere. Well, I but, like I could commission this person again. Is it's very possible? I yeah, do it. It's it's like it's just a process and. Uh, it's a, exactly. it's a little expensive. Like, it's not, like, super expensive, but it's a little expensive. And, like, doing yeah, the full yeah. way, like, actually having the hands moving and then the camera mapping it and, like, all that. That's There's extra stuff there. It's yeah, funny yeah, because, yeah. like, me getting here um, was a culmination. What, what's the word I'm looking for? Calm, it was a collection of me knowing a bunch of things, and then I just... Culmination. <laughs> That's oh, the word. A clue, a clue, a clue, a cl <laughs> that. Um, <laughs> it, it was a collection of me going like, okay, well, I know how to use 3D model programs. I know how to use all these programs I've always looked at. <laughs> it was like, I even knew about the hand tracking thing. Way yeah, back yeah. for previous project ideas, I was trying to do the hand tracking thing. Um, bro, I just pulled out my pen tablet. Dude, I've got this little... Uh, tablet thing. I wish I could show it on screen, but I don't have a camera pointed at me. Uh, and it all it does, this is supposed to be uh, like a partner for your art program. It's a little tablet that has a scroll wheel and six programmable buttons. And I have that set to my expressions and my reset. So if I want to reset my model real quick, I just reset it real quick. 
I'll put it on that. When I was using the other model, there was like more expressions. So I would just toggle through the expressions while I had it. And I can yeah. hold it. Like it's it's completely wireless. So I could like have it part of me and then like pressing it. Uh, that's probably because I really like Sushi Dragon too. I love I love streaming hacks and shit like that. I'm so yeah, yeah. I'm so excited about doing more shit with this. Um, I want to keep on pushing the envelope of what we can do with this shit. So yeah, I mean like maybe, fuck it, right? Abandon yeah. abandon your flesh twitches. It's time. <laughs> it's your turn. Hold on, let me let me What's try. Uh... I'm sure we have one or two concept Did artists that work? in our business. Did that work? Flesh. <laughs> hey, you guys want to shoot at me again? Here you go. Let's go ahead and shoot at me. <laughs> uh, where is the button? Dude. Chad, I wish you could see what I see. It would make more sense why everything takes an extra second. <laughs> oh my god. Is this Here, I'll, I'll do it for you. It's exclamation point aim. I think three people have to do it. I don't think that's why it didn't like immediately. Oh. Work. It's supposed to be like a collection. Everybody does it and then they can fire. And I'm going to keep this one. Uh, there so you exclamation go. Point fire. I gotta tell the motion team that they gotta fix the exclamation points on the ch on their fonts. Ow. Thanks, guys. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> guys, being me. <laughs> thank you, Twitches. Why didn't yours work? <laughs> do you have to follow? Are you not following? Oh, I should make it followers only. Can I do that? Chat? I should make it subscribers only. Chat. <laughs> <laughs> Only subscribers can shoot us. <laughs> um, another big idea I have, because I'm, I'm nothing but an idea guy, I guess. Uh, I really want to do a charity in a space like this. I think that'll be really cool. Where like we can have like different rooms and shit like that, and we do a charity, and we'll cut to like people's different camera angles and shit like that that way. I think that'd be very fun. It'd be very cool. Um. The very neat. Very neat. Uh, so, I, I mentioned how, like, I removed the lag, right? I never really talked about, like, how I removed the lag. So, uh, I talked to the motion team last time I streamed. And they were... <laughs> one of the big things they said is uh, dynamic lights can cause an issue for most people. Because what's happening is that when you add a light to the environment, it creates a dynamic uh, shadow uh, to the set. So we recommend having two to four lights at most for your sets. And if you're a modeler who models their actual set, make sure to use bake lighting because bake lighting will make the whole thing bright. Uh, so you can work with that. And I said, okay, that's cool. I have 37 lights. Do you think that's causing a problem? 37 lights. And they're like, how is your computer <laughs> handling it? I'm like, it's not. <laughs> that's why I have <laughs> um, So I deleted every light, and that was a big one. Second was... Any web-based display image. So basically, if it's um, being capturing of a specific website. So if I capture a YouTube video, when I capture Twitches, when I capture Reactive, it's constantly refreshing the website. And it's constantly trying to do that. So I had four videos over in the uh, uh, starting soon screen. That was like one was an hour long video, and the other one was the music that wasn't even playing. It was just the image for the music that was being played on those computer screens. And then the chat. So the chat was also one too. So because I removed all those elements, plus the live, plus green screen on Twitches, like using green screen on Twitches, uh, removing all yeah. that uh, seemingly alleviated everything. And that's great. And now, like, I don't. I it honestly looks pretty flawless to me. Um, yeah, no. It's it's it. The sets come a long way, and dude, for real. Yeah. I kind of want to like, like, wait. Well, let's go look at the old podcast set. I kind of want to see it, like from the first time that we streamed this. Where's Twitch? Hey guys, subscribe to our Twitch channel. Uh, Twitch TV slash. Oh shit, they're live. I should follow. Oh shit, they're live. Oh my god. Oh god! Oh my Beautiful. god! <laughs> I sound like. Oh that. no! Don't you hate sound like hearing yourself sounding yourself? Wait. wait. <laughs> um, chat, don't clip that. Let's see. Is it on here anymore? Does it count? 
past broadcast. Oh no, is it like deleted chat? Where is it? I guess we'll have to go to our. YouTube this is the channel. first one. Where's the first one? The. The, the the I I can see my me sharing my Japan stuff. I thought that was the first one. No, we didn't even have the set yet. Oh, here it is. Oh wait, no, that's like a clip of the clip. Oh okay okay okay. okay. Uh, highlights. I guess I'll have to go to the YouTube channel. Ugh. Hang on, chat. <laughs> <laughs> God, I hate Vision Edit. Uh, banter buddies. We should just watch all our old banter buddies and see, like, what could get us canceled. <laughs> uh, here we go. Pilot. God. Let's do it. Oh, my God. Man, look at... God, here it is. Uh, Look how far we've come. Man. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's, that's just uh, this Dude, series. That's crazy, though. Look the ninth, this. the ninth uh, buddy. The, bigget, the the biggest thing uh, that like gave me and Midnight a big pet peeve is that we're on the wrong sides. <laughs> like from the original original banner buddies, I'm on the other side. So we had to flip us because I like that's <laughs> I was like, we can't do that, dude. It's amazing how much I've learned this program, though. And, like, at when, was, when did we do this one? Three months ago? In three months, I fucking completely wow, redid the whole that. thing. I mean, that's that's kind of typical Chris fashion there. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take that as a compliment. Uh... You're, you're always tinkering. Dude, it's too much tinkering sometimes, though. Look at the weird bug thing that you got in Japan. Yeah, I have them right here. <laughs> Dude, wow, I didn't even, I, 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 like, literally, I blind grabbed this. Dude, like, crazy. it's, like, behind my monitor. He's right here. Callback. There's the callback. This dude, crazy. I, I abandoned my flesh in that time. Look at this. Yeah. Who is that guy? I don't even know him anymore. I, I buy dysmorphia away from you. Be gone. <laughs> I don't <laughs> see you anymore. <laughs> you are no longer my essence. I am me. Forever. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Now, I'll probably go back and forth, but honestly, like, the big thing is that I didn't like the NVIDIA, like, background removal thing. And I also, yeah, no offense, hate putting up a green screen behind me. Despite having, like, the really nice Elgato one that pulls up, it's just a thing. Yeah. Like, it's another yeah, thing it's I have to thing. pull up in front of me. I just open three programs and go live. <laughs> like, that's what I really wanted. Like... Me too, yeah. I mean, I I I have a nice nice one that like it literally just attaches to the back of my chair. Yeah. And it, you know, that it it's a bit less it's a little bit less uh, fuss. Um yeah. and luckily my space my my space can kind of accommodate it luckily, but yeah. Yeah, just go live inside a cardboard box. We'll call you solid Chris. A funny <laughs> Uh but there's all kinds of stuff I can learn about uh VTubing going forward, but I I like I like, I'm not committed to being, like, a full VTuber. It's just that, like, VTubing is such an interesting project for me. It's not, like, it's not actually that I, like, hate my body or anything like that. It's not real like that. Uh, but I just love what you can do with the tech, and I want to keep pushing it. Like, I'll probably be a terrible VTuber because I won't stream. <laughs> like, I'm only going to stream yeah. this and maybe, like, once a week. Um, I've got too much of a full-time job I'm committed to for that. But we'll see. Uh, I'm just, I'm actually very relaxed and happy that the podcast is working. Because maybe we can actually start thinking about things like topics or something soon. <laughs> We've almost got that figured out. What do you think about Twitches? What am I thinking about? <laughs> you're just so locked I in thought. I, My favorite thing I, is that, like, whenever you're looking at your other monitor, it always <laughs> looks like you're looking right at me. What do you think about? <laughs> or am I just looking at you? Listen, it might be I'm really space. committing to the bit. I'm just like, there's Chris. I actually, <laughs> I put you on this monitor specifically so that when I look at you, I'm looking at you. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. <laughs> Except I have the eyes locked to look at the camera in front of me all the time. So it's going to like. <laughs> You're kind of like side eyeing away yeah. from me. Like, 
the entire time. Chat, should I keep on trying to destroy the 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 podcast? I'm gonna add an art program. I have <laughs> I have the stream thing up. I'm gonna add an art program. See if it crashes. This one's cool if it works. Uh, we'll see if it works, chat. Chat, we're gonna see if it works. I've gotta do a a pose. Okay, so check this out, chat. Hang on, hang on, chat. Hang on. Chat, this is gonna be sick. Twitch, this is gonna be sick. Uh, hell yeah, hell yeah, hell yeah. Chat, you're gonna love this if it works. I think it's crashing. Hang on, it's not crashing. We're good. Oh yeah, check it out, chat. <laughs> So there's a secondary program. I was trying to do this before uh, when we first tried to do this. Uh, basically, <laughs> there's a secondary program that I can inject poses <laughs> into uh, my model <laughs> that can be used. And then uh, I can then detach different parts so like if i want to use my arms i have to go in the settings this isn't quick like i have to go to a program and like disengage certain things apply vz face <laughs> like so now my arms are stuck so if i say don't uh oh we're in oh. we're in ad break again uh oh see like this is a good time to have an ad break we didn't we didn't have a I'm heads up for that ad what the heck we don't need a we don't need it <laughs> Who needs an ad? I think, uh, I, oh, height. I have to change height. There you go. So now I can, like, do different poses. Uh, yo, check this one out. Hey. <laughs> hey. Hey. Yeah, I'm just clicking four or five of them. Dude, I've learned so much shit about VR and, uh, or, like, uh, like, just v tubing especially 3d v tubing there's so much stuff out there that makes you want to go like wow there's actually another program that's also <laughs> where am i looking hello <laughs> hello <laughs> um there's another <laughs> there's another um program that's out there called uh warudo and warudo does a lot of what motion does uh but it's a little too much like everything's very like high resolution graphics and shit like that mm. and while you can make a set in that one too and i think you could kind of basically do the banner body set in that program too uh just the way of like adding your own things is a lot easier for motion like they motion made a lot of work to make it so you can add your own elements into it very easily uh warardo makes it kind of complicated like you work with what they have um, but you can do a lot with what they have. So I think both oh, yeah. programs are gonna like eventually get pretty big. I'm I'm thinking that there's gonna be like one big VTuber that opens up one of these programs and starts to understand like how powerful this stuff is, uh, and then it's gonna go mainstream. Cause this this program is in beta, like beta beta. Like it's not. Man, I talk too much about this shit. Twitch, just tell me to stop. <laughs> Stop. It's, time to stop. it's time to stop, Chris. Okay. It's time to stop. Let it go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Uh, Twitches, what do you want to learn next? What do I want to learn next? What do I want to learn next? I don't know. I, I want to learn what I want to do next. <laughs> what am I going to go to school for? Oh, God. That's that's the big question, isn't it? Graphic design. <laughs> <laughs> Oh God! Get into IT. No. Everyone loves that. Yeah. No, I I have a few ideas of what I want, but we'll 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 see. We'll see. You gonna be a plumber, <laughs> like Mario. Plumber. <laughs> Mario. You wanna be like Mario? I wanna be like Mario. I wanna There's be nothing a wrong plumber with being a plumber. Learn to jump real good. They make good money. They make good money. Chat. Be a plumber. Sure. Be a plumber, chat. Uh, be be a, a, a fast hedgehog. Do What's that. the worst topping you could put on a pizza? The worst topping I could put on a pizza? Casual racism. I was going to say raisins. <laughs> Thanks for watching, everybody. I think it's been a good <laughs> podcast. Uh, we'll see you next time. Uh, hopefully with more cast members. Twitch is going to be there. <laughs> I'll be there for sure. I have to. I'm the one that goes live. 
So thank you. Make sure to subscribe. Midnight. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, Midnight. Love you, Midnight. This might be my favorite ending. <laughs> thank you. All right. See you later, everybody. So Have long. a good night, everybody. Good night. Good night. Good night. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> so, oh, wait. The see you later is cut off a little bit. See you later, though. Uh, hey, see you later, guys. <laughs> Bye-bye now. Peace. Make sure to subscribe. It's a good idea. Yeah. <laughs>